Hey there, Micah here with First TV. I'm sure you've all heard the phrase, work smarter, not harder. And that's the inspiration for today's segment. Here at Burst, we have a community of over 20,000 dental professionals who are a part of our ambassador program. So we reached out to them and asked, what is your favorite dental instrument that helps you get through your day the most efficiently? And you'll get to hear some really great responses. But first, I'm gonna tell you about my favorite instrument. My favorite instrument is the Hugh Freedy Nevi 3, which is a curved sickle scaler. Now, if you look at the Hugh Freedy Nevi guide, it'll say that this instrument is a posterior scaler, which it is amazing for. However, when I was in dental hygiene school, they had us use the H6, H7 for air interiors. And um, I think that that's a really common dental hygiene instrument, but I never quite felt like that I could adapt that instrument well, especially on the lower linguals of the anteriors. My second year of dental hygiene school, we got to start using these Nevi 3s and it changed my life. I am so much more efficient with this instrument and I truly love it um, for the anteriors and the posteriors. Now, this instrument is very similar in its design to the PDT Montana Jack. And so when I was practicing clinical hygiene, if we did not have Montana Jacks or this Nevi 3, then I requested that we ordered some because I knew that I would be working the most efficiently for my patients if I had one of these in hand. Overall, if I had to choose between the PDT and the Hugh Freedy, I would pick the Hugh Freedy. Hi friends, it's Terry here. I am a proud Burst Ambassador and Burst Office Specialist. I have several favorite instruments, but the one I'm going to highlight for you today is one that I don't think anybody will probably um, submit. And it's one that I've come across some hygienist um, not being familiar with um, in the course of my travels into offices. And also um, when I teach, I make sure to introduce this instrument to my students. Okay, so the instrument that intrigues me and that I think um, some may not be familiar with is actually a flexible scaler. Um, so it's this little metal strip here. And I'll explain a little bit more about it. Um, it is called ProFlex Strip and it is now currently made by Waterpick or Densco. Um, and so basically it's a um, metal scaler, or like a metal, almost like a finishing strip um, with little holes that you can see there. And it's pliable, so it bends. And one side um, is smooth and the other side is rough. So what I tell my patients is it's actually kind of like a cheese grater type of idea. So thin enough to slide between the contacts of the teeth and then I wrap the one side that has the grates, if you will, um, kind of a C-shape around the tooth and then um, move it vertically um, from incisal to gingival and then up and down and kind of shave off that pesky little piece of tartar that often um, is just below the contacts on the lower anterior teeth. So I will show you how it's used now. Okay, so as I had mentioned, um, one side of the flexible strip um, is smooth and the other side is little is a little bit rough, kind of like a cheese grater, like I mentioned. And so what I do is, for example, if there was a piece of tartar um, left just below the contact, say on the mesial of 24, I would wrap it kind of in a C shape, slide it between the contacts, wrap it like a C, and then gently you can go back and forth um, as you move up and down that surface of the tooth. Obviously contouring it um, to wrap against the tooth so you don't cause any kind of gingival damage. And you can do that as you move along to all the teeth. And you just kind of grate, if you will, that pesky piece of tartar off. And then to get the opposite surfaces, you would just flip it over, slide it in, and do the same thing. So I do always like to explain what I'm doing to my patients before I start because they look at me a little bit uh, skeptical um, when I come at them with a metal strip. And um, so I do like to explain them. It's just kind of like a cheese grater and we're just gonna get that last little pesky piece off. Hope you try this one out. It's a keeper. 
Okay, I hope that um, that ProFlex um, flexible metal scaler was interesting to you um, and that you try it out. I do want to add that it can be sterilized. It can be ran through the autoclave and reused, um, but obviously it will wear down um, after repeated use. So reuse it a few times, um, and then obviously if um, it's no longer seeming to be effective, uh, grab a new strip. Hi, Deb Backus here, dental hygienist of 36 years, and I'm gonna to talk to you today about my favorite instrument called the Montana Jack. It is a sickle scaler made by the company PDI um, out of Missoula, Montana. And the reason that I like this one, it came out in 2001, is that it's got the double end curved And it's a universal scaler, so it can be used in the anterior and posterior. And I like to use it on light to moderate calculus. And I'm just gonna give you a little demo here. And you just flip your end. It can be used mesial and distal, and it can also be used buccal and lingual. You can use it super gingival or sub gingival to get that calculus off. And this stuff has been on there forever. So anyway, this is my favorite instrument. Hey guys, my name's Kim. I'm a dental hygienist and a burst ambassador in Hope, Arkansas. And Micah has asked us to do um, a little review of our favorite dental instruments. So I am gonna give a huge shout out to Micah for this instrument that I use. Um, a couple of years ago, I had the privilege of working in the same office as Micah and um, I am several years older, and we did not have this instrument when I was in dental hygiene school. Um, I'm sure it was around probably, but we didn't get it in our kits at school. So um, Micah came to work with us, and um, she asked for some of these instruments to be ordered, and I thought, oh, it's just, they all do the same thing. It's a universal, it's an anterior, it's a posterior, what it, you know. Well, this is an EverEdge 2.0, I'll see if I can get it up close to the camera. It is a universal scaler. Um, you can do anterior or posterior. And um, I mean, I just don't have to pick up hardly another instrument now um, when I'm scaling. Uh, it is the best instrument I've ever used. And I just wanna say thank you, Micah. Y'all have a good day, bye. Hey everyone, I'm Erin. I'm a dental hygienist and a burst ambassador. And these are the instruments that you're gonna see when you come get your teeth cleaned by me. Each of my packs is gonna have a mirror, a probe, an explorer, and either a curette, which is a rounded tip, and a couple scalers, which are the sharper straight tips. These two are my favorite instruments. I'm gonna have these in every one of my packs, the 6-7 and the 204. These just scale off the tartar really easily and do a great job at removing anything in between the teeth and underneath the gums. In addition to the metal instruments, I also have a piezo machine that vibrates at the tip and shoots water out and that's gonna flush the tartar and the bacteria out from your gum line and out of those pockets and leave you with a nice, fresh, clean feeling and a healthy mouth. Here I am, Pamela Wan, first ambassador with my favorite. You pretty SO4S scale. Hi everyone, my name is Simone. I'm a registered dental hygienist, close to 17 years now, and also a burst ambassador. I wanted to talk to you about my favorite hygiene instrument that I use. It's the PDT Montana Jack 
It's got kind of a sickle working end. I just love the curvature of that shank. Hey, yo. <laughs> That's what she said. Um, but for a patient, I mean, I know these look intimidating, but you want your hygienist working with a sharp instrument. You know, nothing should be done with a dull instrument. That's no bueno. You're not going to have effective treatment with that. Um, for a hygienist, why I think you should check this out is just because it's so multifunctional. You can use it all around the mouth, anteriors, posteriors. It's great, you know, for the um, contact areas. I like to get into, you know, mesial and distal vercations with it. I don't know. I think it's just really a great overall instrument. I love the grip. I love the lightweight handle with, I believe it's resin, you know. So yeah, check it out. Let me show you. I'm gonna do an extreme close up. Wayne's World reference, yes. If you haven't seen it, check it out. I, I got, yeah. And then you roll it. And you're getting in that contact. Let me try to find something fun for you because I just had funfetti cake at my friend's kid's birthday party. Let's see, I usually got something fun in there. Hey. Anything? Oh, a little bit of plaque. Better go get my burst brush and expandable floss. All right, hope this helps everybody, bye. Hey guys, I am here to tell you about the instrument that I cannot do hygiene without, and it's called the Thin Cert. Um, I think they're both by Dense Supply. One is a little cushy and one I don't care as long as I have it. Um, but it gets in between, and I'm telling you, if you have subcalculus, it's going to find it. Now, I'm not talking about heavy, heavy calculus, um, and that's not what this is for. This is for every six months, people that build up um, in between that you cannot get to with an ordinary instrument. In fact, you may be even leaving some stuff behind if you're not using something this thin, but it just goes right in there, and you can see, I mean, it's so slender. You know, some of the bigger ultrasonic tips are too fat. And that's what causes discomfort because you're trying to lodge that in there. Um, but this is just fabulous for those every six months, even, you know, one, two, three millimeter pockets. This is a great um, tool to use to get in there. So I love it. I can't do hygiene without it. If you are a dental professional, I hope that this segment has introduced you to a new instrument or two that hopefully you could incorporate into your practice to help you become a more efficient provider for your patients. As always, thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe to our channel.